Welcome back, everyone. Well, we're talking about a need for foster families in northern Nevada, and here to join uh, us this afternoon is Lori Nichols. She's with the Division of Child and Family Services. Lori, thank you for coming in. Thank you. Um, there is an important training coming up uh, for anyone living in a rural county if they want to become a foster parent. This is pretty intense. Can you tell us about that a little bit? Uh, yes, the training is 27 hours. Mm -hmm. It's the Pride curriculum, uh, which is for foster and adoptive applicants. Mm -hmm. uh, the dates of the training are going to be November November 30th, December 1st, and December 2nd. Mm -hmm. They don't, it doesn't cost anything for people to attend, but they do need to call me and get that set up. Uh, tell me, uh, what is it, you know, what, what should people expect being a foster parent? What type of a commitment? This is, this is taking care of children, so this is a big deal. Well, it's a family commitment, yeah. really. It can't just be one family member wanting to move forward. It has to be a whole family decision. Um, you're talking about working with kids that have dealt with different levels of trauma mm -hmm. and that's why the training is so important for families to go through that so that they understand the reason for some of the behaviors, some of the reactions that they get, triggers, things like that that, you know, will um, affect kids in their home. And typically, you know, when you foster a child, how long of a time period is that? And is there always an option if you would like to adopt them um, and, and keep them as a, a full-time member of your family? About how long does that go? Well, there's different types of foster care that folks can sign up to, to provide. Um, kids typically come into custody anywhere from between 6 to 12 months is usually the, the standard time. Um, but I think, you know, it, it can vary, certainly. Uh, on each case, okay. Yeah. And, and really quickly before we go, you know, there is such a need out there. I know a lot of uh, people recently became adoptive parents, so there's maybe few foster parents out there available. So why is this critical right now? Well, rural Nevada typically has a real challenge bringing foster families into the fold. Mm -hmm. We are, you know, stretched out across 15 counties, and mm -hmm. so we just need the word to keep moving about the need for foster homes. Mm -hmm. And this training is happening in Carson City? Yes, Carson okay. City at uh, Carson Tahoe Regional Medical Center. Okay. And, um, yeah, it, it's going to be happening there, and we have a large room, so we can fit a lot of people in there. So my hope is we're going to fill the room. Okay, at Carson Tahoe. Carson that Tahoe. said Banner Churchill. Is that not? Well, is there another training there? Or there was a training that started today in Fallon. Okay. But that training has already begun. Okay. So initially that was. So the if training. someone's watching now and they wanted this, that will be at Carson Tahoe Hospital. At Correct. Okay, great. Okay. Yes. Thanks so much. It's nice Thank to you. see you. And thanks for nice giving to us this important you. information. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Joe, back over to you. All right, thanks, Shelby, for that. We'll